In this video, we are going to talk about benefits of vitamin C so before starting this video, please like this video and subscribe to our channel for the future updates. Vitamin C is an essential vitamin, which means that your body is unable to generate it on its own. Despite this, it serves a variety of functions and has been linked to significant health benefits. Many fruits and vegetables contain this compound, which is water-soluble and may be found in oranges, strawberries, kiwi fruit, bell peppers, broccoli, kale, and spinach, among others. The recommended daily dosage of vitamin C for women is 75 mg mg, and 90 mg mg for males. While it is generally recommended that you obtain your vitamin C from foods, many people rely on vitamin C supplements to achieve their requirements. Here are 7 scientifically proven benefits of taking a vitamin C. Let's start. Number 7. May reduce your risk of chronic disease. Vitamin C is an extremely potent antioxidant that can help your body's natural defenses to function more effectively. Antioxidants are chemicals that help the body's immune system function better. They accomplish this by shielding cells from potentially damaging chemicals known as free radicals. The accumulation of free radicals can lead to the development of a condition known as oxidative stress, which has been related to a variety of chronic diseases. According to studies, increasing your vitamin C intake can improve your blood antioxidant levels by as much as 30% in some cases. This aids in the fight against inflammation by the body's natural defenses. Furthermore, vitamin C is an extremely powerful antioxidant that can significantly increase your blood antioxidant levels. This may assist to lower the chance of developing chronic diseases such as heart disease and diabetes. Number 6. May help manage high blood pressure. High blood pressure affects around one-third of all individuals in the United States. High blood pressure increases your chances of developing heart disease, which is the leading cause of death worldwide. It has been demonstrated in studies that vitamin C may assist to decrease blood pressure in both persons who have and do not have high blood pressure. According to the findings of an animal study, taking a vitamin C supplement helped relax the blood arteries that transport blood away from the heart, which in turn helped lower blood pressure levels. Furthermore, according to a review of 29 human trials, taking a vitamin C supplement reduced systolic blood pressure, the higher value, by 3.8 mm of mercury in diastolic blood pressure, the lower value, by 1.5 mm of mercury on average in healthy adults who were taking the supplement. Vitamin C supplements were found to lower systolic blood pressure by 4.9 mm of mercury and diastolic blood pressure by 1.7 mm of mercury on average in persons with high blood pressure. While these findings are encouraging, it is not apparent whether the benefits on blood pressure will be long-lasting in nature. Furthermore, those suffering from high blood pressure should not rely solely on vitamin C for treatment. Number 5. May lower your risk of heart disease. In the world, Heart disease is the biggest cause of death by far. Many factors contribute to the development of heart disease, including high blood pressure, high triglyceride or LDL, bad, cholesterol levels, and low HDL, good, cholesterol levels. Vitamin C may be beneficial in lowering certain risk factors, which may lower the likelihood of developing heart disease. For example, According to a study of nine trials with a total of 293,172 participants, those who took at least 700 mg of vitamin C daily had a 25% lower risk of heart disease than those who did not take a vitamin C supplement after 10 years. A second review of 15 trials discovered that ingesting vitamin C from foods, rather than supplements, was associated with a lower risk of heart disease, which was surprising to some. Scientists, on the other hand, were unsure whether persons who consumed vitamin C-rich foods also led a healthier lifestyle than those who took a vitamin C pill. As a result, it is still unclear whether the changes were caused by vitamin C or by other factors in their diet. Another study examined the effects of taking at least 500 mg of vitamin C daily on risk factors for heart disease, such as blood cholesterol and triglyceride levels. The findings were based on 13 studies. A vitamin C supplement was found to dramatically lower LDL, bad, cholesterol by roughly 7.9 mg per deciliter and blood triglycerides by 20.1 mg per deciliter, according to the findings of the study. It appears that taking or drinking at least 500 mg of vitamin C daily may lower the chance of developing heart disease. 
If you currently eat a diet that is high in vitamin C, however, supplements may not provide any further heart health benefits. Number 4. May reduce blood uric acid levels and help prevent gout attacks. Gout is a kind of arthritis that affects about 4% of adults in the United States. It's excruciatingly painful, and it involves inflammation of the joints, particularly the big toes. Gout patients experience edema and sudden, intense pain attacks. When there is too much uric acid in the blood, gout symptoms emerge. The body produces uric acid as a waste product. It may crystallize and accumulate in the joints at high concentrations. Interestingly, vitamin C has been proven in multiple studies to help lower uric acid levels in the blood and, as a result, protect against gout attacks. In a study of 1,387 men, Researchers discovered that individuals who drank the most vitamin C had much lower blood levels of uric acid than those who consumed the least. Another 20-year study tracked 46,994 healthy males to see if vitamin C intake was associated to the development of gout. It was discovered that taking a vitamin C supplement reduced the risk of gout by 44%. In addition, a review of 13 research indicated that taking a vitamin C supplement for 30 days lowered blood uric acid levels much more than a placebo. While there appears to be a substantial relation between vitamin C intake and uric acid levels, more research into vitamin C's impact on gout is required. Number 3. Helps prevent iron deficiency. Iron is a vital nutrient that serves a number of purposes in the body. It's required for the production of red blood cells and the transfer of oxygen throughout the body. Supplementing with vitamin C can aid in the absorption of iron from the diet. Vitamin C aids in the conversion of iron that is difficult to absorb, such as iron from plants, into a form that is simpler to absorb. This is especially beneficial for vegetarians and vegans, as meat is a key source of iron. In fact, just 100 mg of vitamin C per day can boost iron absorption by 67%. As a result, vitamin C may aid in the prevention of anemia in persons who are iron deficient. A vitamin C supplement was provided to 65 children with mild iron deficiency anemia in one trial. Researchers discovered that only taking the pill helped them regulate their anemia. If you have low iron levels, increasing your intake of vitamin C-rich foods or taking a vitamin C supplement may help. Number 2. Boosts immunity. Because vitamin C is involved in many aspects of the immune system, it is one of the most common reasons people take vitamin C supplements. For starters, vitamin C promotes the formation of white blood cells called lymphocytes and phagocytes, which assist the body fight illness. Second, vitamin C improves the function of these white blood cells while also shielding them from potentially hazardous substances like free radicals. Finally, vitamin C is an important component of the skin's protection mechanism. It is delivered actively to the skin, where it can work as an antioxidant and reinforce the skin's defenses. Vitamin C supplementation has also been demonstrated to reduce the time it takes for wounds to heal. Low vitamin C levels have also been related to negative health effects. People with pneumonia, for example, have reduced vitamin C levels, and vitamin C tablets have been demonstrated to speed recovery. Number 1. Protects your memory and thinking as you age. Dementia is a broad word that refers to symptoms of deterioration in thinking and memory. It affects about 35 million people worldwide and is most common in the elderly. Oxidative stress and inflammation surrounding the brain, spine, and nerves, together known as the central nervous system, have been linked to an increased risk of dementia, according to studies. Vitamin C is an extremely powerful antioxidant. Low amounts of this vitamin have been linked to memory and thinking problems. Furthermore, some studies have found that persons with dementia had reduced vitamin C levels in their blood. Additionally, increased vitamin C intake from food or pills has been demonstrated to protect thinking and memory as you age. If you don't get enough vitamin C from your diet, vitamin C pills may help you avoid problems like dementia. More human research are needed, however, to fully comprehend the impact of vitamin C supplementation on nervous system health. In summary, low vitamin C levels have been associated to an increased risk of memory and thinking disorders such as dementia whereas a high intake of vitamin C through foods and supplements has been found to protect against these conditions. What do you think of our list? Let me know in the comment section below. If you enjoy this video and want to hear from me again, 
be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go. Thanks for watching.